No, this isn't Wimbledon, but if determination counts for anything, it's the next best thing. It's the fifth annual Barry Gibbs Celebrity Love and Hope Tennis Festival here at Turnberry Isle Country Club. Tennis greats, along with TV and motion picture stars, are teaming up for a charity, the University of Miami's Diabetes and Research Institute. And the host of the event feels that he wants to give something back to the place he calls home. I love being here. I love this is the community I live in. And, um, and I think that if you, uh, whichever community you live in, I think you should try and do something positive towards the community. And, that's, and I enjoy doing that. Though the celebrities are out here playing for a charity, it's all not taken too lightly. You see it's about 100 degrees in humidity, at least that's what it feels like. And they're not out here sweating for nothing. They want to win. And sometimes winning doesn't come easy. Miserable. You tend to stay up with friends when you're here. I have a three hour sleep I'm functioning on barely. And I found out they do sell Corona down here too. So far we're breaking even. We were, we're two and two. Uh, and uh, I've lost nine pounds, I think, in the first uh, match. So uh, uh, I like to play. Coming from Los Angeles, it's, uh, we're used to dry weather. It can always be this hot, but you never feel it. The perspiration just kind of stays on you. So as the day goes on, you weigh about 20 or 30 pounds more just from, the, just from this good Florida sunshine. So the competition might not measure up to Wimbledon standards, but the players feel that a little sweat is worth it when you're serving up for a worthy cause. In North Day, Lisa Petrillo, Channel 10, Eyewitness News.